In this video, we'll show you how to get started with User Experience Insight on the HP GreenLake Cloud Platform. As a prerequisite to using User Experience Insight, you'll want to make sure that you have an HP GreenLake Cloud Platform workspace. And to do that, you'll first make sure that you have an HP account and that you've signed into the HP GreenLake Cloud Platform. The third step is to make sure that you've created a company workspace. And in this video, we'll walk you through how to actually add UXI to that workspace and configure your sensor for the first time. User Experience Insight is one of the applications on the GreenLake Cloud Platform. The steps we're going to do to onboard UXI is first, we're going to provision UXI in your GreenLake Cloud workspace. The second step is we're going to add subscriptions. Now, when you first provision UXI on your workspace, you're going to be given eval subscriptions automatically. But when you purchase subscriptions, you want to make sure you add them to the GreenLake Cloud application workspace. The third step is going to be add sensors if you're using our hardware sensors. The fourth step is going to be add any additional users. And the fifth step is going to be to launch the UXI application from your workspace and configure your sensor for the first time through the onboarding wizard. If you're using our UXI hardware-based sensor, you can go ahead and power on the sensor now and make sure it has connectivity to the required URLs. We'll want the status light to be green blinking, indicating that it's waiting for configuration. If the status light is orange, it means it doesn't have connectivity to our UXI cloud. So let's go ahead and get started. So we're starting from the home page of your GreenLake Cloud workspace. And the first thing we're going to do is provision UXI on your workspace by going to Services and selecting Catalog. User Experience Insight can be found under the Networking category. Select User Experience Insight, and on the top right, select Provision. Choose the region as US West, agree to the terms, and click Deploy. This will add User Experience Insight to your workspace, as well as add eval subscriptions, so you can begin using the product. Now the next step is we're going to add our UXI hardware sensor to our GreenLake workspace device inventory. Now you can skip this step if you're only interested in using our agents as well. But to add a hardware sensor, we're going to go to devices and we're going to select add device. We're going to add a networking device and you can upload a CSV file or specify the sensor serial and MAC address. Make sure to use the device Ethernet MAC address, not the Wi-Fi MAC address. Select Next. And the rest of these options are not required, so we're going to just select Next for all of them. Now that we've added the device, it'll appear in our device inventory list. So the next step is to make sure that the sensor is assigned to the user experience inside application. Once the sensor is assigned to the application, then we also want to assign it a subscription and you get eval subscriptions as soon as you provision UXI on your workspace, so choose one of those. Now the next step is to add any additional users you want. So from the home page, select user management, and here's where you're able to select users of your workspace and what roles they have. For user experience insight, you want to make sure that all of your users you want to, ha to have access to the application have a user experience insight role assigned to them. You can choose the role assignment to be administrator read only or restricted read only. 
But just a note about the restricted read-only role is you need to configure the restriction to the hierarchy group within User Experience Insight. Now we're ready to launch UXI and configure our sensor for the first time. When you first launch UXI, you'll be taken to an onboarding wizard. And the onboarding wizard helps set up your sensor for the first time, but you can also skip the onboarding wizard as well. Now the first step is, are we onboarding a hardware sensor or an agent? So if we're onboarding an agent, then we simply select the agent. And you have the agent installed on your device, and you simply scan the QR code to onboard the agent to your dashboard. In this example, though, we're going to onboard a hardware sensor. So let's go back and let's onboard the sensor that we've added to our GreenLake Cloud Workspace. The sensor at this point should be flashing green, indicating that it has connectivity to our cloud. The next step is going to be to configure the network that you want the sensor to test. And you can select the network or you can type in uh, your own SSID name if the sensor hasn't uploaded those test results yet. Now you can enter the SSID credentials and move on to the next page. And this is where you configure the initial tests you want the sensor to run on this network. So you can select a few from the list. And once you're ready, select ready to test. And at this stage, the setup is complete and your sensor will start to report test results over the next few minutes. Now, if you want to configure more settings, the settings button to access it is in the top right behind the three dots. This is where you can access your settings. You can see what's new. You have access to the documentation. And if you want to navigate back to the GreenLake Cloud Platform, you navigate using the icon in the top left. So that's it for getting started with UXI. Thank you for watching.